Hello, beautiful lady. Yes, I am talking to you. It is Thursday, and you know what goes down here on Thursday. Wife Life with Dr. Gail goes down here on Thursday. So do me a huge, huge favor. Make sure you're hitting the subscribe button and the little bell right next to it so you'll know when I go live. We're bringing sexy back. We're bringing sexy back. Let's get it started. Pot, won't you give it up? And so tonight, I want to talk to you about four ways to winterize your sex life. Yes. Now, if you live where I live, you know that it's getting cold all across the country, right? Even places that normally don't get cold are experiencing some cold weather. And so um, as things get cold outside, I want to teach you how to heat up things inside of your bedroom. And so let's get started. The first way to winterize your sex life is winterize your sex position. I know that the reverse cowgirl, the doggy style are one of our favorite ways to get it done in the bedroom. But when you're trying to winterize your sex life, go for something that's more skin to skin. Okay. Yes. Spooning is a great position to winterize your sex life. Also the missionary position. And I know we get tired of doing the missionary position, but do it with like a a pelvic lift or something like that, more skin to skin, more face to face. So you can feel your spouse's body and you can make things really hot in your bedroom. Okay. Number two, gather each other up for warmth, right? And a lot of times we take this for granted, but you see it all over the television. You see it in movies, gather the blankets, fireplaces, or if you don't have a fireplace, get a space heater, you know, do some candles, do something that makes you guys cuddle up on a couch or on the floor, watch some TV and that heat under those blankets or that space heater will just make things more cozy, more romantic, and you will be able to spend more time together because who wants to sit on a cold couch separate? No, bring each other together and get that those juices flowing with that warm blanket, okay? Number three, get some spice with some foods in your life. That is the best way to warm things up naturally, right? And so some foods that really, really work to help get things going is ginger, right? Ginger can improve the circulation throughout the body and especially to your, your sex organs, right? And so that gets things spicing up. So for men, it will help you get erect quicker. And for women, it will help arouse you quicker because the blood flow is circulating throughout the whole entire body. And if you're doing any kind of physical touch and foreplay, I'm telling you, that's hot. The next thing I want you to introduce into your diet is some type of pepper, right? Some kind of hot pepper. It contains an irritant that when you bite the pepper or eat the pepper, it automatically makes the body sweat. Yes. But once you finish sweating, right, that's going to subside and you're just going to feel warm all over. And you're going to want to share that warmth with your spouse. So why not add some peppers into whatever you're cooking, whatever you're eating. I love peppers and chicken. I know that sounds crazy, but peppers and fried chicken, now that's hot. So try that. So add some ginger to get the, the body just circulating and also add some hot peppers. And I'm telling you, you're going to feel hot. Okay. And number four, get your sock game up. And you're like, what? Yeah. Winterize your sex game by wearing socks. Did you know that 80% of couples that wear socks achieve orgasm a lot faster than couples who do not? Yes. During sex, especially us women, if we wear socks, we can achieve orgasm a lot quicker and it's more intense with wearing winter socks. So I say for you and your spouse to get those socks on, 
and get to have an amazing sex. And it's because the body releases a lot of heat from your feet as well as your head. But if you keep those socks on, I'm telling you, the heat is going to rise and it's going to rise in the right places. Okay. I love you guys to pieces. And I pray that these four things help you winterize your sex life. I am here every single Thursday at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I will see you next week.